Yo, what's going on? What's poppin'? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So I got an email from a subscriber, and this one says, Hey, Mr. Locario, my question to you is how to keep myself motivated and in the game while I may have a relationship with a girl that I like and respect. I don't want to stop the game because I'm kind of addicted to it, not for the sex, but for the challenges. All right, so this is the thing. If you got a girl, right, that you really like and you really respect and all that other stuff, right? You got to make sure that uh, you are maintaining that relationship because um, it's very hard to find a chick like that. So the thing is, there's going to be challenges in your relationship that you're in now that you can look forward to if you're into challenges, right? Now, this does not mean that if you're out with your boys and you're hanging out, and y'all are talking to some girls, you know, you can still flirt with chicks. You can still, you know, interact with them and talk to them to keep your mouthpiece crisp. You understand? You can do that. But the thing is, if you're in a monogamous relationship, right, you don't want it to get to that next level. You understand? With another chick and you end up cheating on your girl, because if your game is tight and you are interacting with these women, some of them are going to want to fuck with you, right? Because you might be like, oh, I'm just going to, you know, talk to these girls, flirt with them. And, you know, because there's a challenge here and the challenge there. But then these girls are going to end up wanting to get with you. So you got to have that balance between you flirting with them and just keeping it, you know, talk and conversation and, you know, doing that. And, uh, you know, understanding that, OK, that's all it is. <laughs> you, know, you know what I mean? But the thing is, when you're talking about challenges, there's going to be a lot of challenges that you're going to have in the, you know, committed relationship that you're in with this girl that you actually like. You understand? So I say look forward to those challenges, you know, mainly. And, you know, you know, on your downtime, when you're with your boys and all that, you could talk to other girls here and there just to keep, you know, your mouthpiece crisp. You understand what I'm saying? But the thing is, I would say just focus mainly on the challenges of keeping that relationship together. And the reason why I'm saying this again is because it's very difficult, very, 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 very fucking difficult to find a chick who's worth being in a relationship with, okay? A lot of times guys is getting relationships because the chick is there because they want some ass and they want, you know, they're like, well, I can just stick with her and just keep fucking her or whatever. But to actually have a relationship with a woman who's a good chick, who actually brings something to the table is hard as fuck to find. And the thing is, is that in order to keep that going, you need to know how to maintain that. And there's going to be challenges within that. So I, I think if you want to challenge, you know, look forward to that challenge of the actual relationship you're in mostly. You feel what I'm saying? Because there's going to be a challenge to keep that going and to keep that, uh, you know, the maintenance within that relationship. Because your girl, she's going to be on some bullshit sometimes. She's going to be like extremely emotional. You're going to get into arguments. You're going to get into, you know, different things going on. And in order to keep that going, in order to keep the relationship alive, in order to keep it fresh, in order to keep it exciting, is a challenge. You feel what I'm saying? So don't think that because you have a girl that the game stops. You understand? The game doesn't stop when you have a girlfriend. You understand? This, this, it's a whole nother level of the game. You feel me? So you got to understand that. All right. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you have any questions, make sure you click the link below and I will holler at you later. Remember, the truth is inside you. Peace. I'm gone. Now, before you turn off this video, I want you to do three quick things. One, I want you to click the link below to send me a question. If you have a question on dating and relationships, I'll make a video about it. Two, I want you to click the link under that to get my free audio program, Undeniable Game, which teaches you seven easy to follow tips on how to really attract beautiful women. And three, I want you to click the link under that one to go to Bad Boy Membership, where you get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. Hey, what's up? It's dating and life coach, Mr. Locario. Go to badboymembership.com and master the dating game by joining my Bad Boy Membership program. In this program, you'll receive 45 through 90 minute, easy to follow, step-by-step Step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract, date, and have sex with beautiful women. Join the Bad Boy membership today by going to badboymembership.com. That's badboymembership.com.